Lucky has just OD'd. Hold on, this is going to contain some spoilers, so yeah. New Year's Eve has just rolled around and Cookie has just OD'd on some lace dough. And this puts Spoon and Stretch in a bad spot because she OD'd in Detroit. Detroit as in America. America as in if you don't have any money, you're pretty much f***ed health-wise. Yeah, that's the payphone. After having a moment of clarity, the two-bit hustling junkie Spoon and Stretch decide to kick it. I don't want to go out like that, man. But their decision comes at the worst possible time. Because of a bad hustle, they now have a crazed, violent gangster D-Reaper hunting them down. And it seems like this whole movie, everyone is having a really bad day. The blind vet loses his sh the nurse loses her sh Nobody talks to me like that! And the clerk at the welfare office, who should have his own TED Talk, also loses his and because today is the day you decide to kick the whole f***ing world is supposed to stop. After Stretch calls local drug dealer Mud a nick, he receives the appropriate response. What the f*** did you call me, man? But don't worry, Spoon educates him on the nuances of saying that word in front of black people. It's gonna be a time where you getting your ass kicked. And how he could get f***ed up. You're not black. Now it seems Mud and his pregnant girlfriend Cece are in pretty bad with the Reaper. And as a result, they encounter the usual occupational hazard of selling drugs in the mid 90s, which is to end up not alive. But the law thinks it's Spoon and Stretch that killed them. Now they have the Reaper, the Law, and their monkey on their backs. Da -da -da. Still, they're determined to kick their habit, and still, the city of Detroit is determined to give them. Sorry, but that's still gonna take about four to six weeks. All while the walls are closing in. However, miraculously, Spoon and Stretch get saved, and they come up with a way to beat the system by going through a good old fashioned crackhead plan. Stabby. As it turns out, D Reaper was a crooked undercover cop all along. And Cookie makes a spec recovery and uses the oldest form of communication known to the modern world to leave a message. And they finally get to rehab. VN and follow for more.